Welcome to the 27th Avenue Compost Facility, Phoenix's state-of-the-art facility for turning yard and food waste into nutrient-rich compost. Compost is used as a soil amendment to encourage plant growth for parks, gardens, farms, and more. Materials such as yard and food waste is collected from a variety of sources. The type of material that is collected and processed determines the recipe of the final compost product. Before food and yard waste can be added to the process, contaminants need to be removed. Contaminants like plastic, glass, and metal are manually sorted out by hand. If something like a glass bottle gets into the machinery, it can break into small pieces and makes the compost harmful to spread on farms and parks. This is why composting the right materials is so important. Once contamination is removed, a large machine called an excavator feeds the yard waste into a machine called a grinder. This machine grinds down the large branches and organic material into pieces six inches or smaller, which helps speed up the decomposition process. The materials are then piled into rows called windrows. The material remains in windrows throughout the controlled composting process. Next, Food waste is mixed into the grinded yard waste. Food waste speeds up the composting process by attracting more microorganisms to consume and break down materials. Composting is a natural process that requires water and air to help microorganisms grow, move through the piles, and break down organic material like food and yard waste. Throughout the composting process, water is applied to the piles. Underneath the piles are pipes that can blow air into, positive aeration, or pull air out, negative aeration, of the piles. Positive aeration helps to cool the piles if they get too hot. Negative aeration is used to pull air through the pile to the biofilter. The biofilter, a pile of large shredded wood chips, removes any bad odors created by the composting process. Negative aeration also pulls water down through the piles, allowing water to fully absorb into the piles. Any water that is not absorbed by the piles drains into a retention basin. This residual water is packed with nutrients and is recirculated back onto the compost piles to help the decomposition process while conserving water. As the piles cook, a machine called a turner rotates and churns the materials, letting more oxygen into the piles. The piles are turned and watered for 45 to 60 days until the material is broken down into a very fine blend. After the material has broken down and composted, the new compost is fed into a tumbler. This machine sifts out the smaller 3 8 inch minus material, while the larger material is transferred to a machine called a Herifex. The Herifex is used to screen out stones while also creating a vacuum that removes plastic from the compost. The remaining material is ground down to a two inch minus size. After the finished compost is cleaned and separated, it is set aside to further cure for up to two weeks. A sample of compost is sent to a lab to be tested periodically to ensure the final product is free of weed seeds and harmful pathogens. The finished compost is then sold to a variety of end-use markets. Thank you for touring the 27th Avenue Compost Facility. For more information on what you can compost with the City of Phoenix or in your own backyard, go to phoenix.gov slash publicworks slash composting or call 602-262-6251.